clear. And the loft room has had its trial run and been through, put through its paces. Everything seems to work pretty well. As soon as you put more than one person in here, and kit and things like that, it's, you know, it gets a bit of a squeeze, but um, keeping the whole room free and using the, the office to leave all the kit out there where possible worked really well. So the shoot was for my cousin's uh, business, which is called Basket, The Basket Room. Most of my work is on location, photography-wise, uh, but they wanted to get some lifestyle sort of product shots done of their baskets and things that they sell. It's a really cool company, actually. They sell, or they kind of tie up with um, women in Africa, mainly in Kenya, I think, and all these baskets, they sort of, the design back here and then they have made over there and it's almost like fair trade uh, the fair trade equivalent I think of all these baskets and furnishings so uh, it's really really good business really ethical um, and I'll leave a link to all of the info and the kind of their website and stuff down there and like, they've got online sales and they sell through other outlets but anyway I mean like I said this room is going to be multi-purpose it's going to be for uh, filming uh, videos for the YouTube channel, filming some more of Joe's work, uh, again for the channel, taking product shoots, it doesn't have to be lifestyle like we did yesterday. Uh, when we do product shoots for um, things that are shipped to us to shoot, we'll set up in here, we'll have some lighting. So if you want to see more of how we did this project up here, how we renovated the rooms, uh, and what we used and kind of how we went about things. You can find that playlist, I'll stick it at the end and also in the description box below. Give us your comments, let us know what you think about the room. Of course it's not finished, N none of the rooms are in the house and, and we'll kind of keep pushing to get things like the panelling on the ceiling done, get the wiring finished and some of the little doors through to the loft spaces. But at least it's a usable room now, the floor is painted, clean, We've got the painted stone work, we've got skirting boards in, we've got doors painted, and it's beginning to look a little bit more fresh. So I hope you're as pleased as I am that this project is pretty much finished and we can move on to more exciting things, get the van done, finish some projects in the garden, and just keep busy at it all. So uh, if you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to our channel if you haven't done already. Um, we're a kind of small, slow growing channel, but uh, we love having people's comments and people kind of getting involved in the projects. So there's plenty of stuff in the pipeline for the rest of the year. So please do keep in touch, stay following the channel and we'll see you next time. And remember, if you can, do it yourself.